Hey guys, welcome back to another YouTube video and this one is about Modern Fame Keyword um, Tool and I want to show you guys the, the potential that you can use this keyword tool to maximize your visibility, grow your channel and also for you to understand the analytics of your channel overall and you can use that information to align yourself with the ever-changing of YouTube algorithm. And there are two tools that you need to have and I'm going to just go ahead and say that. It is a Modern Fame and TubeBuddy. These two combined together, just it can do wonders for your channel, especially if you're new or you're intermediate, you need to have these tools because that's the way you're going to help to understand um, your channel overall for you to align formula and strategy to grow your channel and also for you to make the money that you I hope you want to make here on this platform. So the first one, Modern Fame is breaking into two parts. The first one gives you an overall look of your channel. This is a channel by my wife. so. I'll go ahead and use her as, as for, for example because she does have over a thousand subscribers so it makes sense for me to use hers and she have them uploaded for a long while now um since um in the mid-summer of 2018 so but overall still you still can see that um she have the subscribers coming in it's not a lot but it's still happening every day and you can see also that her views are growing 1154 views um, per week and then also you can see that um, 50, 14 percent um, of her subscribers is keep coming back to watch um, her content and also 86 percent of her visitors or the views are coming from visitors so she had the potential to convert this 86 percent into maybe turn this into maybe a 15 to 20 percent into subscribers and also this is the overall views of her channel currently so like i said it gives you a great breakdown and if you see all these tops here you have traction and see what is generating the views and what is helping to grow the channel overall so in the first tab like it says traction so down here you can see for example here you have different tops here you can sort by dates views um average duration likes comments subscribers gain in this case if you also click in this tab it will show you what video is like I said, is converting more subscribers. So if I click on it now, so I click on it, you can see, for example, this topic here about my hair, you can see that it's have um, made the channel grow. Yes. And here, how many views? I can show you exactly how much. And also the average view duration and then the likes and the comments and overall, it showed that 285 subscribers subscribe because of this one video. And overall, you can see that 73,725 views. So she pretty much could go ahead and make more content around because you can clearly see that this is a success for her channel. So she could go again and maybe look for a different, same topic of this one and generate back some more topics in this one going forward. You can see also the second video here. It gained over 150 subscribers and overall made the channel grow, yes. You can see that the views and also the average du um, view duration the likes again the engagement which is the comments you can see that it literally put a lot of um, subscribers into her channel itself in terms of growth wise this one again you can see so much um, it grows again another 36 subscribers through this one 27 for this one so overall like you said this kind of give you not just you to shoot in the dark it gives you a good um, insight and what you need to do going forward and what other video you can structure or make more of so you can help that to boost up your relevancy let your channel grow overall you know bringing more traffic bringing more views because the more views you have our watch time happen on your videos is the more you can have more subscribers you can grow your subscriber base and if you look in the second tab which is the strategy so you can go inside here and like i said she haven't done much um for the past four four to six months so she can literally tiptoe here on the, the average line and obviously you can see right now in terms of her watch time she can do more to improve her watch time um, the rest views and engagement subscribers is on average line so she can literally push this up a bit some more so there's a lot of potential for her to know what to do and in terms of her growth opportunities down below is also shows want more create more of these so she could literally go ahead and start to create more of these videos as well because you can see in terms of views duration likes comments subscribers you can see is bbb a and same thing for this one here so pretty much she could lay off these ones a little bit and try something new and like i said this is the whole idea of using like i said apps such as uh, modern fame or cheap body so you can get all of these data which you can go ahead analyze this in depth and then you can execute accordingly and then again you can see the workshop so you got the channel views for the last seven days then you got views from subscribers views from visitors and you can see here um 
the growth, which is pretty much the same uh, above here. So you can see that from subscribers, um, th um, 38, and then uh, from um, visitors, um, 241. And so you got all of this, then you have the velocity. So you can see how quick um, things are picking up and stuff like that after 72 hours of posting. So like I said, she haven't posted for a while, so you won't see nothing in terms of that. And then on the far right here, you can see subscribers keeping coming back. So this 38 plus, which is a good indication that these are active subscribers. And you need to have active subscribers who can come back um, repeatedly and check out your content whenever you upload and post new contents. So actively, even though she's not on it for the past, like it's a few months uploading, but you can see that actively she have 38 plus subscribers coming back for content. So you can see something's working. So she can go back, I say, into her account and start to upload fresh content, come inside here, use these analytics itself and prepare herself for, you know, growth and stuff like that. And the next part of uh, Money Fame would be the keyword tool, which is awesome. So this is it right here. So just in case you may not have an idea, um, like what you want to literally like, you know, make video for, you can come into your niche as long as you stay in your niche and you can see exactly putting in whatever that is. For her, she's plus size. So I could go ahead and put in maybe the word plus size. And let's see what happens with plus size. So over here, it gives you two main screens. So on the far left, you have um, your main keyword. And on the right hand side, you have like, for example, uncommon keywords. So as you can see here, there's a great choices for a small channel, smaller channels. So you can literally, she could literally come inside here, um, take something from here herself, and then she can able to position herself nicely with this kind of um, keyword here, a search term. For example, now it's winter, so she could maybe, let me see what's up with this one here. So in terms of the size of her channel, as you can see above. So what happened here into the search area? You can see, for example, um, ranking opportunity rating based on. So per video, you can see that she get roughly around 280 views per video. And then you have over maybe 11 likes and also between 8.9 to maybe nine comments per video. So this is exactly the opportunity you can see here. So for you to rank, so this helped to make up all of those data for you. For example, here, it would be difficult for her to rank for this one, merely the fact that she just have um, a thousand subscribers here so that her great hair would be an F. For example, in terms of like views for the 7.5 thousand views, and then she normally get between 270 to 80 views, so pretty much it's an F. For relevancy, it's a good strong B, so that's good for her. But if you click into the suggestion here, it could give you another opportunity for her to maybe run a bit better, I think. So let's see this one. So nothing much have changed except for relevancy, so she get an A from B this time. So we could keep digging some more, I guess. Okay, so let's use this one for example here. So, so far you can see that based on her subscriber on her channel, so she have 1,046. And then it gives her a grade of D. And then, for example, the likes and comments, which is the engagement, so she also have a D as well. She normally get 14. Uh, so inside the relevance as well, you should get a strong B. So the only difference is the view, which is not a lot, but like I said, this is a brand which she's working with. So she could clearly come inside here and create a video around this uh, particular topic, um, which for her brand deal, which she have, and then she can go ahead and able to rank. And then what it is that uh, Monofame does as well, which is an extra bonus, is the fact they normally give you a gateway video. So for her to rank, she should have to all do this video here. So she can click in this video and see, for example, this what is this. So you can click on this when you go to a video that uh, Nico would explain to you in, in that step. But like I said, you can see, for example, 323 views and 14 likes and comments. And this is overall relevance of 76% rele relevance. So if you check back inside here, hers is a good 100%. So she have a stronger presence with this one if she was to go able to run for this one. And one more thing you can see in terms of her subscriber as well, she just has um, 622 subscribers. So pretty much she could be able to run for that because she's standing nicely at 1046. So that's a good um, command for her to run for that Plink Clove um, brand which she's working with. So that's just one good way. And also the next good benefit, like I said, you can move ahead to chose the next step, which is pretty much good. 
So along the way, you can able to do all of your keyword and everything. Make sure you got all the metadata lined up for your video. So you can go ahead and copy and paste. So now that um, become 100, so it's still a good strong um, B. And you can see there, you also help you to populate or generate yourself some nice hashtags that she can use within her description. And so she can just go ahead, for example, choose this one, choose that one, that one. And so the maximum you can have into the description itself is three. So that could be her three and it could be at the bottom and then she could go ahead and script out a nice little description. And then she can copy and paste all of this back into her video while uploading it to the YouTube platform. So that's pretty much. And the next cute thing, she can go ahead and remove um, stuff which is not relevant. So for example, that one, that one. So where you got an X, you can see that this is not necessarily a search term that people are looking for. Because do people search this? And you can see pretty much people are not searching for this keyword. So you can get rid of this one. And... Um, try to look for other keywords to stuff inside here. But you don't have to overdo it, you can just find the most relevant ones. So that's you pretty much ready, and then she can copy and paste all of this. But your next step to this, which is quite cool, is the thumbnail. And you can see down here, it said, um, does your thumbnail draw enough attention when it shows up next to the other videos ranking for your target search term? If not, then try to break the pattern. So you can see here, so she can literally look in this and see, so yours will come exactly right here. So she can see how well she would have to carve out a nice um, thumbnail for her to outdo these um, I mean, thumbnail, which are already populated here. So this gives you that extra um, job so you can go ahead and see. You don't have to be shooting in the dark and see how you're going to fare. This line up all of the videos which are ranking for a similar keyword. And then she can go ahead and use that itself and able to carve out a nice um, thumbnail for her actual video. So that's a wonderful thing that Nico have included into this app. And the next thing that I want to show you guys regarding this tool is this one. It also shows you inside here where your traffic is coming from. So her traffic, 8% um, is Google search. The next 61% is YouTube search. And then the next 31% is other. So you can see strongly that she's ranking nicely. Um, are she doing her good keyword research nicely over YouTube in terms of search? So this is where most of her traffic is coming from. So on YouTube, it can either come from search term or it can come from relevant video, which is going to suggest, or you call it suggested video in the sense, that, which is this is how you can get more views and stuff like that based off of um, suggested videos. So this is, like I said, a nice way for you to use all of these tools um, to, you know, position yourself nicely on YouTube, grow your channel, whether you're small. You can see, like I said, this one is a very small channel at the moment, um, a thousand subscribers and over 200,000 views. So you can see that I'm not showing you something out of this world where you can say, oh my God, how am I going to do this? I'm showing you stuff which you can literally go inside yourself and adapt to this kind of thing, get it done and get the result. So it's nothing too difficult. It's not something, you know, too strenuous on your, on your part. So if you go ahead with the right um, information, like I said, you can go ahead and sort of make videos that YouTube need, not want. <laughs> so... This is exactly the usefulness of apps such as, like I said, Morning Fame or TubeBuddy. So I'll leave all the links to these apps below so you can go ahead and check them out. So thank you very much, guys, for checking out this video. Please like, share, and subscribe to my main channel, which is YouTube Marketing. And you can come back for more content over there. You do marketing for YouTube, Instagram, Facebook, and other platforms. So thank you very much, and have yourself a good day. Thanks.